Hello, my friends. I'm Jonathan Miller, co-founder and artistic director of Sounds Good Choir, and I'm here with some very important news. Most of you know that over the past several years since COVID-19 became a disruptive part of our lives, uh, we have convened a COVID-19 task force, which has deliberated many times uh, with many different iterations of how to respond to the pandemic and how to keep all of our singers safe. Uh, this week, the COVID-19 task force has made a decision that effective with our Summer Rocks 2023 session, which begins in June, the first rehearsal is on Monday, June 12th, we, for the first time since the COVID-19 pandemic hit, will be mask optional in rehearsal and concerts on the condition that the community transmission of COVID-19 is low. So what that means is if you're one of those people who is immunocompromised or otherwise feeling cautious and you want to sing with a mask, please do. Mask optional means you always have permission to wear a mask if that feels like something that's important to you. And maybe it's a week when you're trying to make sure that you're, you know, that you don't catch a cold or something like that. Uh, always feel free to wear a mask. That's what mask optional means. For those of you who don't want to wear a mask in rehearsal, that means you can take your masks off. You don't have to test beforehand. You don't have to let us know anything like that. This is a really big step. And the COVID-19 task force takes safety very seriously. It also takes into account what's happening in the wider world, what the CDC recommendations are, and so on. Uh, we think we're still offering a safe environment uh, in that masks are still optional. We're always requiring that singers be vaccinated and boosted, so that has not changed. Um, but again, effective the week of June 12th, uh, our rehearsals and performances until further notice will be mask optional. And again, I wanna underscore that it's on the condition that community transmission is low. The moment community trans transmission in either Cook or DuPage County goes from low to medium or high, the masks are gonna come on. So I think for many of you, this will be good news. And for especially for people who haven't come back uh, for a while, uh, for those of you for whom masks have been an impediment, um, we hope that you will uh, come back and join us. And for those of you who have stuck with us through thick and thin through the entire pandemic, uh, you have a choice whether you want to continue to mask or whether you uh, want to sing without masks sometimes or all the time. So anyway, I want to give a huge thanks to Doug Lieberman, who's the chair of the COVID-19 FAT Task Force, as well as Jenna Eisenberg, Lynn Clark, Hannah Dixon McConnell, Anna Brothers, as well as uh, Sandy Siegel Miller and Helen Gagel uh, from our staff, uh, and Laura Simchik and our interim executive director, Sujata, who have been really terrific in supporting all this. So again, thank you for being part of this wonderful singing family, and we hope to see many of you for eight weeks of Summer Rocks. Thank you so much.